AC Leak Freeze is a, is a new product on the market that the simplicity of use uh, surpasses most others out in the industry. It's fantastic. I mean, it's just a simple syringe, apply the hose to it, inject it, and you're pretty much done at that point. The product sells itself. It's so easy to use compared to, there's, there's probably four or five of these units that I'm aware of uh, in this area that people use. Uh, AC Leak Freeze is by far uh, the most commonly asked for just because of the simple use, just because of the ease of use. I believe it takes about 30 minutes for it to become fully active. Uh, and it's, it, the geyser, it's a quick call. Uh, it's perfect for people who are on a budget. There's no fear that it's gonna affect the unit. It, it, it is totally compatible with, with all the, the common furniture that we use in the industry today. It sells itself, it's a perfect item. In this hard economic times, a lot of people are very, very uh, penny pinching. They do not want to spend any extra money than they have to. I understand that. AC Leak Freeze is a product that allows homeowners to extend the life of their unit. Unlike aerosol cans, AC Leak Freeze comes in a clear syringe where you can actually see the product entering the system. Uh, people love to see that product going into their system. Contractors love to see it. It's proof positive that something's going into the system is actually doing its job. It allows that customer to keep that money in their pocket for a while longer, uh, two, three years, as long as they need to, uh, until they can upgrade a system or get a new system that does not have that tiny leak that was so hard to find with a leak detector. I would recommend Leak Freeze over another product because Leak Freeze is a one component item going into a system. I would say in my 25 years of industry experience, Leak Freeze is the first item that's come into this industry that I've seen that is a one component product that's so easy to use and that many contractors are asking for today. You're not using Leak Freeze, you're doing yourself wrong.